Fashion in the world of Pokemon gets really weird when you look closely. We'll start off strong with Red. Red is fine. Well, he's not fine, he's an 11 year old who gambles and fights people's pets, but he looks how you'd expect. I do want to point out though, because you wouldn't believe me otherwise, that his shoes have belts. Mine don't, maybe yours do. And his button shirt? Uh, isn't, nor does it have a zipper, and it has one clasp at the top like it's a cloak, but it's not a cloak, it's a short-sleeved shirt. Don't let it gaslight you. His 2003 redesign looks like he at least did well in school before dropping out. Unfortunately, he got stuck with these oversized, practically flared jeans, which for some reason Nintendo thought was the hippest fashion choice back in the early 2000s. He looks surprisingly great in the t-shirt that Blue got him for their Hawaiian honeymoon. If only we could turn that frown upside down. Actually, that looks kind of creepy. Blue is looking casual with jeans and a simple shirt, although he's also strapped into some pretty hardcore boots. Then in 2003, he gets hit with those same baggy cargo pants, and he gets a fanny pack and half a popped collar. All of this together doesn't say edgelord so much as it says both of my divorced parents tried to dress me at the same time, and also they're blind. By Gen 2, he's now 14 years old, which is apparently old enough to start teasing some midriff action with a cropped jacket. Heck yeah. On his Hawaiian honeymoon, he was, as I believe you kids say, a dripping. And don't say, oh, it wasn't a honeymoon, they're not gay. Uh, strike one. And also, his capris match his shoes. And need I remind you, he owns a cropped jacket. I don't even own a cropped jacket. He's gay, they're gay, keep scrolling. Actually, wait a second. His collared shirt has a tiny lapel, which also means it doesn't button up all the way. This is not a real shirt, blue! We came so far with you only wearing clothes that actually exist, then you ruined our honeymoon! Ah. Where do we start with Leaf? Or when do we start, I should say? Leaf is wearing a tank and skirt from 2003, a leg warmers from 1973, a hat from 1903, and what I can only assume are painted clogs from the 1300s. Overall, a historical treasure. Her Let's Go redesign just deletes the time anomalies, which leaves nothing left but a black void staring back at us. Lastly, if you want a lesson in the psychological power of indoctrination, consider that you believe Misty to be the platonic ideal of hotness, yet she is wearing a cropped tank and short shorts with suspenders. Logically, we know this to be morally abhorrent, but we do not question it. We were never given a chance to question it. Misty is beautiful because we collectively misimagine her to be, and beauty is in the eye of the beholder. But we are wrong. But she's kinda hot though. I'm not even into chicks, and I would play Mario Party with her. Join us next time when we journey to Johto and the fashion gets much weirder.